Hey folks, it's Cat Beanie and welcome back to another Divergence episode. Now, today we're sort of starting off strong. Now, I was actually recording this while Sugar and Adorable Ho were doing their own live stream while they were in a different um, ancient city. Now, as you can see, I have just picked up the Ward Armour Trim from the ancient city. Now, this was um, over... I want to say like three hours of work like I can't remember yeah I was in the ancient city for about two to three hours uh it didn't take me two to three hours to find armor trim I think it took me about two hours um to find ward um still haven't found silence but we got one out of the two of them me and digging truths uh have been live streaming um, other ancient cities because there was like three more close by to this we've already done one so you can see that live stream on the live stream but um, as you can see uh, I conveniently died like I stuck all my stuff in the end or end portal not the right word um, in my in my chest in my ender chest um, and you know, did the sacrificial death thing and ended up back at spawn. So, like, it's just an easier way to travel. <laughs> it's like, it's, it's just like, if you are like a long way away and you have access to an ender chest, just bung all your stuff in there, do the sacrificial death thing, and boom, you're you're back. Everything is shiny and right with the world. So, like, I got the ward trim. I didn't want to stay in there any longer. I didn't want to... Like, I had to go to bed. It was, like, it was, like, really late at night for me. I think it was, like, I don't know, 12 or 1 in the morning-ish. And, like, right, I've got one. One will do. It's, like, obviously everyone's, like, all uppity about, oh, silence is the best one. Silence is the best. It's great. It's awesome. It's, like, yeah. I'm, I'm, um, I don't, I think, I don't understand why there's so much emphasis put on silence i mean right don't get me wrong it's a, it's a nice trim um i just i just don't get the hype though is it because it's in the ancient city and if that's the case shouldn't ward also get the same amount of hype is it because of the design uh, in which case yeah pretty cool i will admit um but yeah, I just don't, I just, I just didn't get the hype. I mean, I got, I got a bunch of goodies, so that wasn't too bad. Um, in the live stream, um, but I was going to say in the live stream I just did with digging, but I can't remember if I, I don't think I was actually doing the live stream today. I think that was just digging. Yeah, I don't think I was recording or anything at all. I think I recorded a little bit of it, but not a lot. Um, so as you can see, I grabbed the trim. I didn't, I didn't come out of the ancient city as soon as I grabbed the trim. I did go have a look in a couple of more chests, get al unalived a couple of times and stuff like that. And me and Diggin, go check out her live stream because I'll definitely be on hers. Um, we did a second ancient city and we still have not found silence, but we have got two ancient cities to go. Uh, I have already dug out the tunnels to those ancient cities or where I hope those ancient cities are. So hopefully we will find silence in one of those. Oh my god, sorry, I'm recording this like quite late at night cause, and it's going to be like another shorty video. Just check and see if I've got any. I need to stock up on my potions, although nobody is buying them, so you know. I thought I had restocked like my mending books and what have you, but no, they're still sitting in double chest next to my villager area. Um, not doing anything or helping anyone at all. I thought I'd stuck them in a shulker box and uh, brought them with me last time, but apparently I did not do that. Um, now, if I had any like hindsight, I probably would have got some cobble deep slate, grabbed one of the ender chests and got diamonds out of there and duplicated the trim at spawn. But clearly that is not what I did. I take my happy ass all the way back to my base 
to duplicate the trim, although I do need to stick one of them on one of the item frames. Now, I have taken off a few of the item frames inside my base, and I'm going to tell you why. Like, apparently there's this thing that... Um, item frames increase the world size exponentially um, or can I don't know if they still do, I don't know if it's a bug but like, I was like right well hopefully if I reduce the amount of item frames I have up in my base um, obviously that will hopefully reduce the world size a little bit I don't know if you guys heard that I just bopped my microphone so um, I did have like the Deep Slay versus Stone Ores around my map wall. I've still got my map wall up, but I did have like the ores around there. Um, but like I have since taken that down just to hopefully, you know, save space a little bit and I took some other item frames down some non-essential item frames I was like right I can still have these things um, still collect the things that I want to collect I did also take the I used to have a token I don't know if any of you folks have seen um, The Sandman on Netflix I also own the whole collection the whole um, graphic novel collection by Neil Gaiman but that's another story um if you guys have seen The Sandman on Netflix, you'll know that when he goes to his gallery um, to call one of his siblings, they all have some sort of token um, that he uses to summon them or call them or talk to them or whatever. And I thought it would be cool to me, have something like that um, to represent each of the divergence, which I also had up on my walls. And look at all the item frames I have. I'm going to have to probably do something with all the ones down here. Although how... I don't know if signs will work, but anyway, duplicating the armor trim. Um, I don't know how it's going to work because obviously I don't want to be trolling through my barrels all the time looking for stuff. I think the ones that are used for storage are probably going to be essential, but I'm going to try and take down all the non-essential item frames and maybe find another way to, you know, showcase my stuff. So as you can see, the compasses over there, they don't have the tokens above them to represent each divergent because obviously sugar was sugar. Um... Adorable hole was a hole. Um, Married in Minecraft was the turtle helmet that they gave me. A Manchu was the Wither Rose of Friendship. Buster was some redstone because that's what Buster do. Um, Digging was a flower. And what was silly? Oh, he was the rich. He was the rich people cookie. So yeah, I did have all these tokens to represent them, but. Like, trying to trying to save some space here because the world thingy is over a gig by now and it's like eh, eh. right I need to get some more glowstone as well but um oh my god I keep yawning right so we've currently got 10 armor trims look at that look it's so pretty it's so pretty. I think I try and take a screenshot here as well. I can't remember. My brain is fried. Honestly, it is like I probably shouldn't be recording this at this time of night. It's like ten to eleven at night time, but it's what's it? So two, four, six, eight, ten armor trims. Yay! Um so we still need silence and we need um the nether right. So we need silence, we need the nether right one. Um we need snout. Is it snout? Uh, Vex, I think, and Spire, and then I'm sure there's sixteen. So there's one that I'm missing. Is it the one from the eighth and the one from the uh, the one from the fortress? Maybe I forget what they're all called. Uh, Oh, I got that. I'll just take those to spawn. I can stick them in there. Stick them. In. No one has actually bought any armor trims, but I have a feeling that obviously most people will have. 
um, already got a lot of them themselves or aim to get them themselves, which is fine. Um, but they are available. I should, probably should have just made like one copy of each and put it up for sale and save my diamonds instead of like putting multiple copies because like that way if someone had wanted a copy of one I could have said okay well you know you give me X amount of diamonds and I will you know pony up an arm of I've got ponies on the brain now um, sorry I've just came off moderating a stream and there are many ponies. Anyway, uh, <laughs> it's funny though. Um, I th like I had a thought to like leave this like Diggins one because obviously me and Diggins are sort of like a team. Um, any trims that I get, I share with her. Any trims that she's got, she's been sharing with me, um, et cetera, et cetera. Um, so I thought, right, I need to leave this in her base somewhere. I was trying to think about where to leave it and I was like, right, uh, I don't know. And then I thought, right, we'll, we'll leave it uh, in Frosty's box. This is Frosty the Snowman. Uh, but I do change my mind and take it all the way to spawn. Because I'm thinking, right, I need to go to spawn anyway and, you know, stick some of them in my little kiosk, my little trim kiosk area sorry digging if you see that I just trampled all over your stuff anyway it's fine it's fine it's, it's crops they'll be fine i don't i didn't have a hole on me i'm sorry so right i thought right i'll go to spawn i'll stick this stuff in my sh kiosk bit i will stick digging's one in um her post box and then that will save my brain from having to explain or oh, dig in by the way if you got your base the armor trim is in blah blah blah, blah by the snowman and, 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 and instead of just saying by the way it's in your post box or there is something in your post box go check your post box um i like how if i just follow a man shoes um elytra rings like takes me to spawn eventually let's get in there Ooh. I can't even remember the last time I used that tunnel. So here's my little Molly coloured kiosk because like it is Pride Month. You have to have rainbows. Um and it's pretty, I like it. It's it's all lit up and it's nice and look at all the pretty armor trims. I mean if nobody if nobody wants to buy them, that's fine. I mean I suppose I, I can use them for something eventually. I mean I do have backup uh netherite gear and whatnot. Um I think Buster said he wanted to buy some armor trims, but I don't know if maybe 15 diamonds each is a bit steep for his blood, I don't know. I don't know, but the reason behind that was because obviously armor trims are a one-hit wonder. After you have them, you can duplicate them many, 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 many times. So, um, once someone has it, there is no need for them to come to you to get more. So, you know... Hence the steep price tag. If I'm only getting paid once, you better make it worth my while. Um, but anyway, yeah, let's pop this in Diggins' post box and that'll be that. Anyway, thank you for watching, folks. Please remember to like and subscribe and I will catch you in the next one. Goodbye.